The main drivers are the continued um, growth of value-added uh, sugar and sales, particularly in the Caribbean. This year, we saw very good uh, prices in the Caribbean um, because of the, the, the challenges that other producers are having in the region, and Belize has been able to uh, fill some of that gap. Also, prices in Europe uh, increased significantly because of shortage in that market. And we also saw improved prices in the U.S. Although we only have a, a quota to the U.S., that price was also one of the highest that we've seen. So the global uh, improvement in sugar prices, the good value for the direct consumption sugars that we're producing, the port savings that we are also seeing due to lower freight costs, all these factors contributed to the record price we saw this past year. I, I don't think so. I think certainly we've seen... Um, excellent sugar prices this past year. We know that sugar prices can be cyclical, but one of the things that we've, why we advocated for moving into value added is that we wanted to cushion from the, the volatility of raw sugar prices. And so I think the investments we've made um, and those strategic initiatives to move to more value added, for us, that is what will help us to be more sustainable and competitive.